Hi friends, my name is Bennett from GSM Promit. Today I want to share with you a free software to unlock your disabled or passcode lock iPhones that are currently running on iOS 12, 13, and 14. So apparently from iPhone 5S or to the iPhone 10 or iPhone X, you can use the software to unlock it with SIM working for free. Before you unlock this phone, you first need to jailbreak it to get SSH connection between the software and then the device. If you don't know how to make a bootable USB to jailbreak the phone, I'll leave a link in the description below. So go watch that video on how to make a bootable USB with a minimum of 4GB pen drive. So as you can see in the video, I'm actually or currently booting from my ring USB that I've prepared to jailbreak the iPhone. While the check ring is loading, if you are new to this channel, kindly hit the subscribe button and also hit the bell icon to get notified anytime I upload a content like this. This is an online tech support platform where you can simply and effortlessly get solutions to your lock devices and also if you are new old to this channel thanks for coming back once again Okay, so this is the setup for the check ring patched. You click on the arrow pointing right to continue. Then you click on continue. And then at the top left corner, you click on utilities and then terminal to launch the terminal. Now you type in 10 and hit enter. To launch the check ring now you have to connect your device in dfu mode to put the device in dfu mode whilst the phone is on you press and hold the power button and then the home button together simultaneously keep holding the buttons the two buttons till the phone goes off or the screen is blank then you release the power whilst holding the home button So once you see that the software detects the phone, then you release the home button. If you haven't subscribed yet, please kindly subscribe. If you don't understand anything, please feel free to leave a comment. I'll make sure to reply you as soon as, as soon as possible. Or you can join our Telegram group when you check uh, our YouTube page. There's a Telegram group there. Yeah, you can join. Okay, so right, we are done with the jailbreak. Now we're on my desktop. You connect to your Wi-Fi network and then launch the software FRP2. I'll leave a link to this tool in the description. So once you learn the tool, you, you, you have to connect the device. For the first time, the software is going to flag your device as unregistered. You click on the serial number to copy it, and then there will be a link on the on the tool saying click here to register for free. So you click on that and register. You are actually adding your device to the Alocaho server. So you click on the first link when the page opens. You scroll down to this side where it says register serial number. There is a prominent button over there. You paste the serial number there and then wait for some few seconds to submit the serial number. Again, if you haven't subscribed, please do me a favor and hit the subscribe button and also hit the bell icon. It to help me in the long run. Okay, so now you click on submit. We have successfully registered the device. Now let's go back to the software. 
now to make the software detect now software the software still detect your phone as unregistered so you eject the phone or remove and reconnect the device to reload the information on the tool okay so now you can see it says registered so now we can proceed with the next step okay so the next thing to do is to click on the backup data at the top right corner So as you can see now the backup is done and we can see our backup data or the activation files in the tool backup folder you can identify that with the serial number of your device as you can see in the video we have to check if the device have the software have successfully backed up our activation records from the device so now you click on erase the erase to format or erase or restore the device so that you can read your breaking read your break and then um restore the activation files that we've extracted so as you can see i've started uh, my device has started um, restoring Okay, so once the phone boots up, you restart the PC and re jailbreak the device once again. So over here, I'm not going to go through that step by step again because we've done this before. So I think you guys have an idea about to about how to jailbreak. So I'll fast forward this side. As you can see, I've already fast forward this side to make the, already the video is too long for me. I really want to make this video short as. So okay, right. Welcome back to the desktop. You connect to our phone network, and once again, you launch the software. So after jailbreak, jailbreaking the device, after the restore or after the erase, you relaunch the tool and restore the activation files. As you can see on the screen, the device is on hello screen or activation lock screen. So all you need to do is to click on activate, click on the activate um, passcode to um, restore the activation files. It may take a while, you can decide to fast forward this side. The device is respringing.
okay so for some reasons it will get stuck at 90 percent by default i don't know um what actually the problem may be it might be some misconfiguration error between the device and the tool so for some reasons it will get stuck at 90 percent i've encountered this problem with two different devices and i think it's not a big deal when you see this don't panic um whilst you wait till you wait and you see you didn't see any change or you didn't see that um the 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 progress bar didn't move from the 90 if it doesn't move from the 90 to maybe 91 or to 92 or something you have to re reboot the device and once you reboot it will automatically skip the setup to the home screen so as i said for some reasons it it may stack at 90 percent i don't think this will happen to all the devices Also, well, wait if you haven't subscribed yet once again please subscribe so as you can see i've been waiting and it, the progress bar still remains at 90 percent so i'm trying to reboot the device so as i said earlier you reboot the device and then it will skip the setup so as you can see i'm rebooting the device let me move this to the main screen okay so we've successfully bypassed the passcode lock on this iphone as you can see after i've rebooted the device it's now on the home screen with sim working so let me try check the call side and see if it will go through okay so as you can see calls is the call is working same thing applies to the data so this is a full bypass with sim working thanks for watching See you in my next video.